Merry Christmas everyone! Welcome to this Christmas video where today we are going to be trying out all of these peppermint candies. Um, these are kind of the Christmas edition of a lot of these popular brands that we're going to be trying like Dove and Junior Mints and Lind Lindor I guess, um, Ghirardelli. So we are looking forward to this very tasty uh, taste test that we're going to be doing. It's going to be a tournament style taste test to figure out which of these Christmas peppermint candies is the very best. We are planning to put a poll out probably as soon as this video goes live, so make sure to go vote on that for a new series idea we might be doing. Also, we're trying to get to 1,000 subscribers, so if you haven't already subscribed to the channel, we would really appreciate yeah, if you did so. So close! All right, so we're gonna be pairing these up two at a time, and we're starting off with Hershey's Peppermint Kisses and Brock's Christmas Nougats. All right, we're gonna get started off with the Brock's. Um, these kind of look like the typical hard peppermint candies, but um, they've got this little Christmas tree right in and the also, center. And also, these are these are chewy. So yeah, they're not... kind of hard chewy. Yeah, hard chewy. So it's gonna take a minute to chew these. Give us a second. I like chewy candy. Um, it's got a pretty. Mm. I was gonna say mild, but actually not mild. It's got a pretty good peppermint flavor. Mm-hmm. Um, not super strong, but I don't know why I was expecting like potent. some sort of chocolate in there. No, no. I have no idea why, but yeah, it really just tastes like peppermint. It's just chewy it's peppermint just a chewy, flavor. It's almost like the hard peppermint candy, but in a chewy form. Mm -hmm. Which, in my opinion, was the best form for that. Yeah, I agree. So, Although okay. I think these might be a little too chewy, or like a little too hard to chew. They're really getting stuck in my teeth. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Alright, I finally got it cleared out of my mouth, so let's go ahead and move over to the right. Hershey Kisses. I definitely have had these before. I probably have them every year during Christmas time. Really? Um, yeah, I mean, I don't have them a ton, but just uh, every year during Christmas I time I have call. one or two. So I know what they taste like. I think I like them. They've got tiny little bits of peppermint, whatever, I guess. I don't know, candy, peppermint candy in there. Mm -hmm. So it's got the soft, normal Hershey Kiss um, texture, but plus these little hard bits. Yeah. Which um, are kind of fun. It's kind of weird. I don't love the taste when you first put it in your mouth, but then the aftertaste is good. It is good. It's a white chocolate mm -hmm. uh, flavor. The I would say the peppermint isn't at nearly as strong as the other one. What do you think? That's definitely true. Same. Yeah, you taste a lot more white chocolate than peppermint. But and subtle hint of it. I thought I was totally going to like these ones way better because I just really like chocolate, but I think I actually like the flavor of the Brock's. What's it called? Christmas nougat better. I'm not a huge fan of white chocolate and I do like chewy candy. So the only thing I didn't like about these was how much they got stuck into my teeth. But yeah, I think I can look past that and vote for these to go All forward right. to the next round. I'm pretty surprised by that. I thought chocolate was going to win every time. Next up, we've got Signature Selects Peppermint Bark and Junior Mints Peppermint Crunch. All right. I've had Junior Mints, but I have not had their Peppermint Crunch edition. So uh, let's start over here. They and... look kind of weird. <laughs> Um, they're not normally shaped like a junior mint. They have like these bumps and yeah, stuff. like peppermint bumps on yeah. them. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Um, so let's go ahead and, and give peppermint. It a try. Peppermint. What are these called? Junior mints mm -hmm. are typically pretty potent. I would say. So oh. I'm curious to see what they taste like. The with texture. That. The texture is a lot different. Yeah, that was weird. Normally it's, they're a little chewier they're, than that. Yeah, they're chewy. These are they're more just, crunchy. Oh really? They're just oh, soft to me. Oh, I didn't even notice any crunch. It was just like melt. It was just, like melted into my teeth right away. I got some crunch right at the very beginning. These have a slight peppermint flavor, I would say. Not super strong. Really? Yeah. You taste the peppermint a lot? A lot. I don't know if we're tasting the same candy here. Because I'm weird. getting crunch and you're not. I'm getting peppermint and you're not. Well, I noticed the crunch the second time. But they're definitely not a normal junior, junior mint. They're similar. Mm -hmm. I really like it. I, I like it too. Um, okay, so now for Signature Selects mm -hmm. Peppermint Bark. I haven't had this before and I'm really looking forward to it. It looks pretty good. It looks very good. I'm going to have to cleanse my palate because the, I just don't want to mix peppermints together. Okay, so this is a dark chocolate and white candy coating, it says, with sprinkles of crushed peppermint on it. Okay, so, so let me know what you think, but I got way less peppermint flavor from this one. The Junior Mint has a much stronger peppermint flavor and this one is mostly just dark chocolate. Yeah. It looks like they took those, like basically candy canes, crushed them up and sprinkled, sprinkled them on top. There's mm -hmm. not really, I don't think, there's none on the inside. No. So that's a little bit disappointing that there's not more candy cane or I guess peppermint flavor in that. What's not disappointing is that it's really good chocolate. That is true. <laughs> 
But as far as peppermint goes, mm -hmm. I agree. There's, I mean, you can see it on there, but you can't really taste it. Exactly. So I think just because of that, the right. junior mints are going to have to yep. win. Junior mints going forward. All right, on to our third round. We've got Dove Dark Chocolate Peppermint Bark against the Great Value Starlight Mints. Mm -hmm. Now, if you've been alive, <laughs> if you are a yeah. person watching this video, you've probably had these before because these are just the classic uh, peppermint candy. Like, mm -hmm. everyone has had one of these. Um, but I was also going to say this round is kind of the formality round because... I just can't imagine these things winning in a peppermint contest over something like Dove yeah, Chocolate. I don't think so. Um, I bet there are people that really love these things, though. I mean, I like them. They're good. They're, yeah, they're good, but... Like an after-dinner mint or whatever, like, good, it freshens your breath, but... I'm not really that excited by eating this. I like, <laughs> it's fine, right? It's a mint. That's yeah. pretty much it. It is really smooth, though. Do you notice that? Mm -hmm. Like... It, it just glides around in your mouth. And and it's got a good peppermint flavor. I mean, these are the great value ones, so ah, I don't know. If but that, we've done uh, a great value versus name brand video before, and great value actually did really well compared to some of the name brands. Yeah. So I wouldn't knock the great value brand. Hmm. Okay, well, I guess it's time to spit this out. Yeah, we're not finishing this. I'm not going to move on to the yeah. next round. So now on to the dark chocolate peppermint bark. And this stuff looks pretty fancy. I don't really see how it could lose to those. I mean, they're good, but they're not this good. That's good. Dark yeah. chocolate layer on the bottom. It looks like white chocolate on the top with mm -hmm. some peppermint pieces in oh, yeah. the side. Mmm. And I am kind of a Dove fan. I really like their chocolate smooth. Mm -hmm. Texture is great. Mm -hmm. I love how smooth the chocolate is. And then there's also a little bit of crunch from the peppermint. Yep, there is. Even the white chocolate, I'm assuming it's white chocolate on the top. And I don't like white, white chocolate that much, but... But it's good. Overall, this thing tastes really good. Yep. Easy win for no the doubt. Dove. <laughs> yep. We're saving the best for last. So for this final matchup of the first round, we've got Lindor's White Chocolate Peppermint Truffle, and over here we have Ghirardelli's Peppermint Bark. All right, very nice. These are going to be really good. And I hope. They, we got these for a buck at Walmart in these mm -hmm. cute little boxes. They come with two each, so we're not like sponsored by Walmart or anything, but <laughs> if you still need a little stocking stuffer, these are great little yep. options. But anyone that works at Walmart, if you do want to sponsor us, well, <laughs> any of the higher up people, you know. <laughs> we'll take it. We'll take it. <laughs> All right. So, right, so this getting started with Ghirardelli. same thing as the last round with the what was it Dove? Yeah. Where they have the white chocolate on top and dark on the bottom, or maybe it's milk. But. Uh, this doesn't say, so I'm assuming this is probably milk chocolate on okay. the bottom. It looks lighter. So, all right, well, let's give it a try. Ooh, my goodness! Very, ex very uh, similar experience mm -hmm. with the or as the Dove. Now I'd say the but, peppermint pieces aren't as big like i still kind of mm -hmm. notice the texture difference but not as much as the dove but in terms of the taste of the chocolate i think i like it a little bit better oh really mm -hmm. well you are a milk it's chocolate good. and i'm a dark chocolate so. yeah all right we only got a couple of these things so unfortunately i'm only going to be able to eat half of it even though it's much more satisfying to pop the whole thing <clears> in my mouth so i'm not sure if you can do that let's see oh oh don't forget all that stuff yeah, right I have there to, i have to get it mmm this is more of a white chocolate experience. That's so good. Lindor knows what they're doing. Knows what they're doing. Um, that flavor I would say is pretty potent compared mm -hmm. to this, in yeah. a good in a good way. Yep. Um, because this is best peppermint candy. Yep. And that has a great peppermint. That flavor. That has a really good peppermint flavor. And the, that stuff in the middle, what is that called? Yeah. The um, the brain blank the, out. The brain. <laughs> the brain blank out right now. Um, that's the soft uh, truffle. Stuff. The soft truffle stuff. Filling. Yeah, I guess that's a truffle, huh? <laughs> I don't know why I get You know, if you've it. had a Lindor, you know what we're talking about. That stuff is really good. Nice and smooth and creamy. Mm -hmm. So even though these are really good, I would have to say that yep. for a peppermint candy, boy, that's good Definitely. stuff right there. All right, first matchup of the semifinal. We are back with the Brocks and the Junior Mints, mm -hmm. and we're gonna try to go through this a little bit faster so we don't keep you guys waiting for the final yeah. verdict. All right, so let's start these Junior Mints. I remember these are super like light. And... I'm, again, surprised by the texture because I'm expecting a normal Junior Mint, and even though we just had these, I already forgot that it has a different <laughs> texture than a normal yeah. one. It's just like so soft, mm -hmm. and it's got a really good peppermint flavor. Yeah, really. 
good peppermint flavor. And it's, I'd say, maybe the strongest one. Maybe, yeah. All right, now for Brock's. These things are really chewy. If you like your candy to last a while, these are great because they do take a while to chew up. Yeah. Um, and it's got a good flavor. It's not as strong as the Junior Mints, I would say. Mm -hmm. So I'm kind of leaning towards the Junior Mints. What do you think? Yeah, I was going to say, these are pretty much just the Junior Mints without the chocolate. <laughs> and who doesn't love chocolate? Right. So the Junior Mints have got to win. <laughs> All right, they're going forward. For the final of the semifinals, we've got Dove versus Lindor, and this is going to be a really hard round because yes. I want both of these to move on to the final. They're both so good. This is kind of the maybe the final round before the final round. Yep. And one thing that you got to love about Dove is their little uh, special yeah. messages that they put on the inside of their wrappers. They're kind of fun. Very great. Um, this one says, "Find comfort and joy in chocolate," and we are certainly doing that right yes, now. Yes, we are. <laughs> we most definitely are. However, I'm going to start over with the Lindor. All right. Oh my goodness. I love truffles because yeah. you bite through that harder chocolate shell and you get into that smooth, creamy middle. Mm -hmm. And with this one, oh, it's got a really great peppermint flavor. It does. I mean, that, yeah, that's just incredible. That truffle, even it's if like it didn't- melts in your mouth. Even if it didn't taste good, it would still be good because <laughs> that experience with the soft truffle in the middle is great. Mm, that's all, it's all really good, really, mm. really good. Man, can Dove beat that? I don't know. <clears throat> I really like Dove. And I really like dark chocolate. I know you're not as big a dark chocolate fan, but mm. I don't know. It, and it's white chocolate, and it's still excellent. This is going to be hard. This one's got the little bits of peppermint candy in mm -hmm. it, which is nice. That really does add to the experience. Mm -hmm. I think you can't taste the peppermint flavor as much as the Lindor, mm -hmm. but you can feel it. You can feel the little shards of peppermint. Man, okay. I think we're going to have to do a hand over fist on this one. I Hand over fist. I don't know why. I said that like several times. Oh, yeah. Have a hand over our favorite. Okay. And then we'll see which one's going to the final. I might have to just let you decide because no. I don't know if I have. We both pick our favorite. We both pick our favorite. Okay. Ready? No, not at all. <clears throat> the texture right. of this one is just so, so amazing. But the flavor of the dub is maybe slightly better. I, mm. I don't know. All right, I'll give you, uh, what, uh, two and a half seconds. Okay. Okay, on three. One, two, three. Oh, <laughs> my goodness. Okay. I'm so sorry, Dove. You probably deserve to be in the final. Yeah, for sure. But, uh, sadly, unfortunately, you yeah. can't be. Lindor, you got to the final, baby. <gasps> Wait. Oh. <gasps> They we, gave just us got, an extra... we just got a bonus candy no in the last way. box. We just totally lucked out. We got three in there. Yeah, there's not... Wait a minute. It's only supposed to be two, right? Yeah. yeah. Well, four total, right? Well, I mean two in each package. Oh, right. Yeah, two in each, two package, each package. And we got... What? Three. Wow. So sometimes... That's amazing. <laughs> I'm keeping this on my side for later. Sometimes they just come through with yeah. the right... Oh yeah, the package. Let's I guess get we the should package over here. put that there. Yeah, we're like we're stunned here. We we're not it, ready. So. Okay, anyway. I don't think this is gonna be a competition. You know what? Good job, Junior Mints. No one would have thought they would have made actually, it to the final. Who but. actually makes Junior Mints? Toots I don't Tootsie know. Roll. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. You know Tootsie what? Roll makes the chocolate Junior on mints. the outside kind of does remind me of a okay, Tootsie Roll, but yeah, maybe I could see that. That's kind of weird. Okay, so. Hey, you know what? We and we've got old. two soft candies Yeah. Um, going to the final, which is kind of crazy. All right. Hmm. I get okay. to eat a whole ball for this one, so. All right. So this video is just about us enjoying eating chocolate. Mm. Mm -hmm. Don't even need to try that one. <laughs> it's it's really, really good. Mm -hmm. Excellent. All right. But we do have to. I'm going to clear it. How can you do that without clearing okay, it? Okay, I'll get some water. Final round, you got to be like... Totally on top of it. Mm -hmm. So we're on to our junior uh, mints. Junior mints. We have to try them. I'm gonna have to put two in at once, okay? Because there's there's no way you can beat that. Yeah. Mm, I mean, yeah, they're really really good. They made it to the final for a reason, but if you like peppermint, no question. Yeah, it's it's it delivers a great little peppermint flavor. Mm -hmm. um, probably less cost than the Lindor. I was gonna say, yeah, you only um, get well in our case we get three, but. Yeah. You only get two in here for, I guess it's pretty cheap, a dollar. I don't then, know how much those cost. Yeah, they but there's actually, a lot more than two in here. They were actually a gift, so. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. 
Anyway, still a great candy, but it does not compare to the Lindor. Yeah. So Lindor, nice job on the Christmas uh, edition. Irresistibly smooth. We noticed that. Yes, Didn't we read did. that before. Peppermint white chocolate truffles for the win. We hope you guys enjoyed this Christmas edition YouTube video, and if you did, make sure to leave it a like and subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas.